fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Thursday the 31st of October 2024. Isn't that Halloween? I think it is. Uh, isn't Halloween the last day of October? So if you're having fun uh, going to a party or something later, enjoy yourself. Um, don't be afraid there are no such things as ghosts. Although we don't Although in Thailand, people would never listen to such sanity. <laughs> of course, there are ghosts, they'll say. Um, what's going on in the world? I see there's a story in today's Guardian. So since the story is in the Guardian and involves both my, my country of birth and my adopted home, uh, I should read it. Uh, a fleet of 30 luxury cars worth six and a half million pounds uh, were whisked out of Thailand and after being uh, fraudulently bought on finance and they were found to be in Thailand having been sold by uh, legitimate dealers uh, and these include Lamborghinis etc etc and the worst thing is that I'm only mildly surprised by this story <laughs> no, not absolutely shocked um, I, the only thing that uh, no it doesn't really shock me I'm afraid <laughs> I'm just mildly surprised that they were sold through legitimate dealers uh, I, I, you would expect them to be sold more on a kind of grey market um, that's what normally happens I guess uh, but um, we do see the occasional La I see the occasional Lamborghini around here in fact there, there is a Lamborghini showroom not far from where I live and uh, I do love those cars, I must admit, <laughs> even though they are destroying the planet. Let's hope for uh, all electric um, supercars that I will never drive anyway, but um, I do like the look of them, I must admit. Um, right, <laughs> enough nonsense. Today's Guardian Sudoku puzzle is uh, of the supposed hard variety. I say supposed because those people who are used to this used to playing the Guardian's Sudoku games will know that they often fall rather short in terms of difficulty when compared to the other games that I play on this channel such as the New York Times puzzle and the LA Times expert level puzzle anyway though a hard level puzzle it is or it claims to be and we'll find that out right now let's start I can see a couple of things already then so we got fours blocking up here like this that's gonna put four into that square and we've got sevens blocking across here and down there just gonna give me seven in that square that's what I noticed we've got seven blocking up and seven down I'm now seeing putting a seven there and sevens across here looks like we're gonna finish off the sevens already I see in the UK they must have changed to um, Greenwich changed back to Greenwich Mean Time because the puzzle only appears here now at 7 a.m. it used to appear at 6 a.m. when they were on British summer time that's how I know the clocks have changed if my sister doesn't tell me the clocks have changed uh, I, I notice it from the time the Sudoku appears we've got four blocking across it and up here that's gonna put four into that square we've got six blocking across it that's gonna put six into that square Shall we pause for breath or not? No, let's not. Six down, six up. No, that's the wrong way around. Six up, six down, I should have said. I can't even get my um, orientation right here today. Um, my up is my down. We've got six blocking down here, down here, and across there. That gives me a six there. And I think there's one more to be had over here. Is that right? Oh, no can't get I, weirdly I thought that was pointing down so no that's I'm wrong sixes are there welcome to the channel channel of Sudoku mistakes never mind though don't worry too much about it it's just a simple game nothing to get excited about twos blocking up there puts two into that square there two blocking across here and across there Two blocking up here puts two into one of these two squares blocking across here, two across here, two up and here and up there. Gives us two in that square there. And actually two across here and there I've just seen at the bottom now. So two there, up there, up there. Two and seven are finished. Let's continue with these fours again now. Four up here like this, there's a four. Okay. 
Uh, and what are we looking for here? Three and five. Don't know which is which. What's over here then? Not three or five. Eight or nine. Um, okay, so nines are up there. So that means, oh, we've got eight over here. Look, eight there. Do we pause for breath now? I think we might have to. I'm just looking for digit five and I don't see digit five. I think it's a, a five less game. I think we are lacking fives. Yeah, no, I've just looked at the whole grid now and I don't see a digit five and it's taken me, I'm, I'm, I'm probably 40% of the way through the grid, am I? <clears throat> Before we notice, I say we, I mean me, of course. So, how is that going to work? Okay, we've got eight blocking these two squares here and eight blocking this square. So in this row, here is our eight. Keep seeing one five nine are the tricky digits, I think. Let's have a look at the nines. Can we do anything else about the nines? Yes, we can. We can get nine up here, across there. That's going to help, I'm sure. Nine blocking down here and down here gives me nine there. Nine across here, nine down there. Nine up here, nine down here, but because the nine blocks across here, nine's got to be in one of these squares blocking back in that direction, means that that must be our nine. Uh, I can get this, can't I? This is three and five, so this is eight for this row. Eight blocking up here puts eight into one of these two squares blocking back down, so let's go down here, eight across there. <coughs> Excuse me, there's the eight. Yeah, soon there's only going to be fives left. <laughs> three up, three down, that's going to put three into that square there. Four blocking down here and across there means that that's our four. So we've got one five here, there, there, and here. So this is going to solve, this is going to give us our first five because now we see one blocking here. We know one is there, and that means five must be in that square, and that square, and that square. So now we have some fives to play with. <coughs> Uh, we can get this, can't we? Missing digits here are 1 and 8. So this is going to be something. 5, I guess. And missing numbers here are 1 and 4. 4 across there. There's our 4, there's our 1. One more digit to get here. That's got to be a 5, hasn't it? And five blocking down here and five across there gives us five in that square. Nine blocks across here for here, the nine here. Here's the one. One across here gives one in that square. Missing numbers down here are three and six. I'm not sure which is which. Uh, let's see what we're lo looking for over here. One, three, nine. We got three and nine together. Oh, I just realized there's only one number missing in this column. Didn't even notice. That's so typical. 
Uh, right, we've got one blocking this square, this square, and this square. So in this row, that's got to be our one. This is three and five, so this is going to be three or five. Any help on that answer? No, not yet. Okay, never mind. We've got five blocking up here, five across there. So there is our five. And now we have five across here, five up there. We know that's our five. So five blocking down here. There's our five. There's our three. Three to the bottom. Three there. Six in this square here. Six blocking across there for a six. Here, one more digit for this column. Seven, are you? No, not you're not. Don't lie to me. Three. Okay, I accept that answer. Uh, and you must be a f... f uh, <laughs> no, you're not. I can't find the numbers. Eight. Eight blocking across here gives me eight in that square. Missing number here is one. Um, one blocking up here puts one into that square there. Uh, what's left here? Three blocking across there. There's our three. Eight is it? It goes here. Uh, this is three. And nine finishes the game. That's all very straightforward then apart from the missing five at the beginning. Didn't take long to locate at least one. And so the game is over. See you around later on. Bye-bye.